and I thought you were asking me if I was in the U.S. I'm like, you know where I am. <laughs> I'm in San Francisco. Oh, it didn't leave him in there. Okay. So what we should do to start off, um, this is Vlad's house when you guys open the game. Vlad lives up here in Forgotten Hollow, up on the very top of the hill. So I just moved my sim in with him, and um, we're going to be doing some training. So let's send her upstairs. I want her to go ahead and start getting some PowerPoints, which she will be using to like get some, um, I'll show you PowerPoints are over here. So, oh, get her energy. <gasps> she already has four PowerPoints. Oh, we should send, do something. So to get PowerPoints, you can um, uh, ask other vampires to like duel you can ask for knowledge and you there's so many other things that you can do to get these PowerPoints and these PowerPoints are spent on this chart which are really cool these are we are a fledging vampire so this is kind of the area that we have the, to spend our pet points on when you spend it points you do eventually have to take weaknesses and you get to pick and choose all of this stuff too and if you're playing along and you're like I don't like anything I picked I want to start over there's a drink um, I forgot the name of the drink. Oh, remind me to look it up. You can drink the drink and get all your points back. So you're not stuck forever. Time to update some legacy rules. <laughs> I love it. Okay, so I do want her to... I do want her to do the bat form. That is something I would like. We still have two points left. Um, cast hallucination. Everyone needs a friend. Hmm. Do we want her to have friends? Eternally welcome. Gain the power to lock and unlock doors at other Sims homes. Occult student. Esmeralda is beginning to study her vampiric energy and she and the many ways it can be used. It can expend less energy. Oh yeah, you know what? We should do occult student because we're gonna be doing all three aspirations. Ooh. And it looks like this one has a three tiers. So the current tier is a cult student. The next tier is a cult disciple. Dis you know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> you cannot wait to play this challenge. If you guys play this challenge, send me a tweet and let me know. Send me your picture. A cult student, I know, right? I think the door thing would be useful for turning people. So we have to remember to do that one too. I think so too. Um. It'll probably take a little while to get to you. They're a little busy. <laughs> oh, Carrot, I've been having so much plan. I actually played this for 15 hours straight last week in one day. And I was like, I should take a break. <laughs> so the next level is going to be um, a cult disciple. Through study and practice, Esmeralda has reduced the amount of vampiric energy. Okay, gotcha. So we don't have to take any weaknesses yet. The weaknesses are really awesome. Uh, Oten, someone tell Oten to refresh. <laughs> They're probably still stuck on the uh, on a different screen. Okay, so we're gonna have her come up here, and to start earning some power points, we're gonna click on the computer, go to Vampire Secrets, and search for information on vampires. I really want her to. Um, get to level tw uh is it 15 in the vampire lore so i'm really excited longer than three hours yes uh luke min yes i am i will i'm gonna try i'm um i suffer from chronic pain but i'm gonna try my best today yesterday i think i streamed for six hours which is outrageous for me yay we got some stuff done on our aspiration become a vampire we did use a computer to search for information on vampires yes we now need to read encyclopedia of vampirica volume one to help us along our way for this master vampire um it says oh we get a reward trait when you complete this aspiration of master vampire it says reward trait a true master as a true master of vampires esmeralda can use the irresistible command power on all offspring what that's amazing almost seven hours yesterday holy moly it was a oh you like the music thank you it's called approaching nirvana they're amazing 
been listening to them for a long time. There's so many times I've gotten to the game at night and I've been like, what do you mean it's 4 a.m.? Right, little? I've done that too. Or I play it, I'm like, just five more minutes. Just five more minutes. And like six hours has passed and I get up and I'm like, what is happening? <laughs> Don't push yourself. Thank you, Anne. I, I know you know the situation I am in, so chronic pain is the worst. We unlocked a vampire tome. Esmeralda has discovered the Von Flavius Vampire Emporium. While searching for vampires, she can now purchase Encyclopedia Vampirica Volume 1 on the computer under Vampire Secrets. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and do that. Purchase vampire tomes. Uh, Encyclopedia Britan Britannica. Wow, that's how you know um, I am old, because I said Britannica. I think I have, yeah, let's turn autonomy back on. I had autonomy off because I was taking photos last night. You do that all the time. Carrot, I'm so happy to see you back today. I'm so happy I got to meet so many of you guys on the raids yesterday. It makes me admire, oh yeah, I was in an accident years ago that left me um, permanently disabled. So I am disabled. Um, we, ooh, Hudson Christensen. I don't know who you are, but I want to bite you. But I can't bite him because I don't have the ability yet. Um, but yeah, I uh, I am disabled. So gaming is, is really fun. It's, it's like a nice way to escape and enjoy my day. Then you get to play with the Be Right Back screen. Yeah, the Be Right Back screen is a lot of fun. <laughs> Make sure you guys stick around for the Be Right Back screen. We're going to give him a funny introduction. I feel like if he is... Wait, I think he's a vampire. Cannot drink. He is a vampire. We should make vampire friends. Hug, MCG. Hug to you, too. You'll just have to make friends so you can invite them over. You guys, we're totally going to order, like... Look at Vlad in the background laughing hysterically. We're totally going to order food for delivery, and I don't mean like pizza and stuff. I mean what we did yesterday in the live stream when we ordered pizza and we turned the pizza people. I only look 25. I am much, I am considerably older than 25, but that's very nice of you. <laughs> Vampire toddlers. Oh yeah, we will be having babies. <laughs> oh, <laughs> stripper grab. You're so sweet. Sam Donut, welcome back. Damn, the massage people, you guys, how many did we turn yesterday? Can you guys remember? We're going to do a vampiric spar with this person because it will give us uh, some points. So, yeah, we're definitely going to do that. I want to get as many power points as possible. I was watching Andrew Arcade, uh, an amazing human being. I met Tim at Sim Camp last year. But I was watching his gameplay video last night, and he says a, a way to get uh, a lot of points really fast is to have spars. So we're going to be doing a lot of spars. You were too giddy with excitement to remember babies. Oh, yeah, amazing. Yeah. You look so young, though. It's video games. <laughs> Did we win the spar? Whoa, we totally won that spar. Let's uh, request some training with him. That will give us points as well, and we'll show off some powers. This looks too much. Uh, oh, my God, this is too much. Look at them, I know. You say spa, I hear spa. <laughs> so what does she want to do? She has a whim, gain vampire rank from being a vampire, perform vampire actions, and use vampire powers. We're gonna go ahead and pin that one because we will be getting some ranks. This is so cool. She totally beat his butt, you guys. She's like, I was raised by a master vampire, Vlad, the guy who founded Forgotten Hollow. I can totally kick your butt. If the makeup works, um, Sim Donut, <laughs> um, I, I just got out of cast, but you can test it in like 20 minutes because it'll be available for you guys. Spa does sound amazing. Doesn't it sound amazing? Speaking of spa, remember when we invited the massage lady over yesterday and we bit her? <laughs> All of these vamp animations and effects are so pretty. They really are. You know what's neat is if you if you are playing with a regular human and you have this pack in your game, your human sims can talk about vampire stuff, which I thought was really cool. I wonder how normal sims want to be. I know, huh? I know. I totally evicted Vlad from his house yesterday, so my legacy founder. Oh, <laughs> imagining. Um, I have. 
Yay, Simville! Thank you so much for the follow. I hope you enjoy your stay here. I, uh, I, we're gonna have her read, uh, some Encyclopedia Vampirica Volume 1. Um, we, I have killed off Vlad accidentally, um, on purpose. I have moved him out of his house. <laughs> Poor Vlad has had so many different experiences every time I've played. Um, I have one for my computer, so when I video game, I have my arms. What does that even mean? Written Bay, how are you feeling today? How's your tummy? Poor Vlad, I know. Chat made me kill him yesterday. It was so sad. One hour, Oten, yay! Poor Vlad, it's literally elder abuse. What is he doing? Anyways, I should move my water bottle. He is, oh, he's on the computer. He's playing computer games? Well, at least he's enjoying himself. Does he have anything in his inventory? He doesn't. Drews! Thank you so much for the follow. I hope you enjoy your stay here. How awkward is this? We just kind of break out a book and start reading in front of the guy that we just dueled. <laughs> oh, a Snuggie? I have my Sims sweatshirt when I get cold. And I'm wearing pajamas. See, I'm wearing an EA shirt. But from waist down, I've got pajama pants on and slippers, so I was shocked to see that Vlad is set as a young adult. Yeah, I'm happy though, because we get to keep him for a little bit longer. Esmeralda read that vampires can be out during the day as long as they have a ceiling over their head, which stops the most powerful of sun rays. Oh, that reminds me. I want to show you guys. Um, on the bar, so let's say you... Um, Oh, I don't think she can do it. Maybe Vlad can do it. Make drink. There is a certain drink. Um, oh, it's not in here yet. Shoot. I'll have to wait till we um, get a little bit further, then I'll show you a very special drink. Can you make elder vampires? Yes, you can. That's a great question. You can make them um, ages teen and up. Esmeralda learned. We just read that. Discovered plasma packs. Yay. No, 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 no. Don't put that book there because I need to see where you put the books. <laughs> oh, it's okay, Oten. Thank you for coming by. This pack, Rain Bee, is coming out today in like 30 minutes. Depending on where you live. <laughs> um, okay, so let's see. It says, discovered plasma packs. Esmeral discovered that there is an alternative method. <laughs> That's nice. Alternative method for vampires to satisfy their thirst. You can now order plasma packs on the computer. Yeah, we're definitely going to do that. So I'm going to have her come up here onto the computer and get some plasma packs because as we're wandering around to bite people and meet other vampires, I am sure she's going to want some plasma packs. So vampire, uh, you click on the computer, click order, and ooh, we can already get garlic seeds. Yeah, let's get garlic seeds. Capri plasma. Yeah. <laughs> Leggings are pants. I guess so, huh? I, um, I gotta pause it. I can't wear leggings because before I got hurt, I was an athlete. So, I mean, like, hardcore athlete. So my thighs are bigger. So leggings don't fit on me. Would you want to be a teen forever? School every day? That'd be awful. That would be awful. <laughs> Internet search. Okay. I'm not getting it right away either. Um, 30 minutes. Yeah. Imagine a vampire accidentally spearing all the way through there. <laughs> Can I pineapple? Oh gosh, the food talk has already started. I, I am hungry. Okay, so order. We're gonna get some garlic seeds. I'm gonna get one pack. Cause I want her to have a little garden. Order. Um, hmm. Let's see here, vampire secrets. Order plasma packs. I'm gonna have her. Uh, I'm gonna have her get ten. The neat thing about this challenge is money doesn't even matter. We're not even here worried about getting money or doing any of that kind of stuff. So pineapple is a strange. Oh, it's so good. I my favorite is pineapple and banana peppers because you get the sweet and you get the spicy. So what I'm gonna have her do is open this garlic pack. Oh my! Now my mouth is watering. I'm gonna have her come over here and uh, plant just one, and then we're gonna hire a gardener. 
so we don't have to worry about this. So we know this is at least here, so if we wanna make drinks or anything, we can, uh, or some food, we have the ingredients growing on standby. Oh, Carrot, thank you so much. That is such a sweet thing to say. They are very uncomfortable around garlic. I completely agree, yeah. Um, there is a thing you can get in the PowerPoints. Actually, I'll show you. They can have like a tolerance to it, I believe. Fresh pineapple? Oh, but it's so... We're gonna hire a professional garter. Um, hey, Beer Beer! Yeah. Um, Kit, Tr Chuck and I have missed you so much. Thanks for hiring from Gardeners United. Your gardener will live on Wednesday at 9.05. Okay, so they're coming today, so let's not water this just yet. I'm gonna have her do some more reading. Uh, continue reading your um, pineapple, pepperoni, and how, okay, so if you guys had to build your perfect pizza, what is your perfect pizza? If someone came up to you and was like, I wanna buy you pizza, you can have as many toppings on it as you want. What would you guys have? Pineapple and ham. Oh, I haven't had that for so long. You know what I really like is I love to take, this might be seeming weird, you guys. I like to take blue cheese, like really chunky blue cheese. I used to dip my pizza in ranch, but now I'm a blue cheese person. Hey, Natty, welcome back. Stuffed crust pepperoni. I've never had... Penguin, I've missed the crap out of you. Best pizza I ever had was a tuna one. Oh, that sounds terrible. But I'll try it because Italy and tuna. <laughs> barbecue chicken. I've never had barbecue chicken pizza. Because I'm a vegetarian. Oh, that is right. You can eat blue cheese. Yeah. You like cheese? <laughs> yes, Mars. But then I take sriracha and I like put it all over on top of my pizza and then I dip it in chunky blue cheese. <gasps> oh, we had pizza for dinner last night. We had um, like a freshetta or something because they're like three bucks where we live. They're super cheap. Esmeralda Lestat is now a minor vampire. Yay. She has started the ascent to the unhallowed rank of Grandmaster Vampire. Keep using powers, researching vampires, and talking to other vampires to earn more vampire experience. So that is how you get more experience. This is so exciting. Esmeralda read that frogs are a valuable source of materials for creating your own plasma packs. Someone reminded me we have to go out and get frogs. Discovered plasma pack creation. While reading about vampires, Esmeralda learned the secrets of converting fish and frogs into tasty plasma packs. Oh my gosh, someone reminded me that we have to go fishing, so I want to try that. If you turned a teen into a vampire, do they still need to go to school? Yeah, they do. Lucky, that's a great question, but they do. If you have a sim that's a vampire that has a job, they still go to work, but they don't burn to death, so it's okay. That is cheap. Yeah, it's like $3 or something. It's really cheap. Um, the basic sauce and cheese. So, oh, not just plain. Oh my gosh, I want sushi for dinner. Frog plasma delicious. Oh, Maddie, why are you so sad? Esmeralda read that frogs are frogs. Frogs, a valuable source of materials for creating your own plasma packs. Okay, we, we read that. Oh, don't you put that on the ground. Uh, what time is it? Okay, it is 7 a.m. I think I'm gonna have her work on her pipe organ skill because that is part of this challenge. Uh, I do that because no tomato sauce. I used to know someone that was allergic to tomatoes. It was so hard. They couldn't have spaghetti sauce, pizza, salsa. Did you just say you were vegetarian? I am vegetarian. I was vegan for a month. I'm like, I miss, I, I miss cheese. <laughs> so I've been vegetarian for like, like eight or nine years. But yeah, I'm veggie. Why are we high-fiving? Why are we high-fiving? <laughs> And um, we're going to be doing some training. So let's send her upstairs. I want her to go ahead and start getting some PowerPoints, which she will be using to like get some. Um, I'll show you PowerPoints are over here. So, oh, okay, good, her energy. Oh, she already has four PowerPoints. Oh, we should send, do something. So to get PowerPoints, you can um, uh, 
ask other vampires to like duel or you can ask for knowledge and you there's so many other things that you can do to get these power points and these power points are spent on this chart which are really cool these are we are a fledging vampire so this is kind of the area that we have the, to spend our pet points on when you spend it points you do eventually have to take weaknesses and you get to pick and choose all of this stuff too and if you're playing along and you're like i don't like anything i picked i want to start over there's a drink um i forgot the name of the drink i'll remind me to look it up you can drink the drink and get all your points back so you're not stuck forever time to update some legacy rules <laughs> I love it. Okay, so I do want her to Oh, Ren, I thought you were asking me if I was in the US. I'm like, you know where I am. <laughs> I'm in San Francisco. Oh, it didn't leave him in there. Okay, so what we should do to start off um, this is Vlad's house. When you guys open the game, Vlad lives up here in Forgotten Hollow, up on the very top of the hill. So I just moved my sim in with him to... I do want her to do the bat form. That is something I would like. We still have two points left. Um, cast Hallucination. Everyone needs a friend. Hmm. Do we want her to have friends? Eternally welcome. Gain the power to lock and unlock doors at other Sims' homes. Occult student. Esmeralda is beginning to study her vampiric energy and she, and the many ways it can be used. It can expend less energy. Oh yeah, you know what? We should do occult student because we're going to be doing all three aspirations. Ooh. And it looks like this one has a three tiers. So the current tier is occult student. The next tier is occult student. Disciple, dis you know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> you cannot wait to play this challenge. If you guys play this challenge, send me a tweet and let me know. Send me your picture. A cult student, I know, right? I think the door thing would be useful for turning people, so we have to remember to do that one too. I think so too. Um, it'll probably take a little while to get to you. They're a little busy. <laughs> oh, carrot, I've been having so.